Confusion over vaccine supply. Is Canada getting shortchanged? Good evening, I'm Tara Overholt. Some provinces raising doubts about whether our country will receive the doses it was promised by the end of March. But the federal government says we will get what we paid for. The Premier was expected to speak to the shortage today. However, he cancelled just hours before, with Health Minister Tyler Shandro taking his place. Shandro pointing the finger squarely at the federal government for not meeting the needs of high-risk Canadians. Federal officials informed us that we will, in fact, be receiving 63,000 fewer doses in the first quarter. Tyler Shandro says Alberta's vaccine rollout has come to a standstill after the federal government notified them for the third time this month that Alberta's doses of Pfizer have been slashed due to a production problem. Shandro says the feds should have negotiated better priority off the top and wants them to do it now. For Canada to go back to the manufacturers and negotiate that and to plead with them to provide us at least with an equal amount of priority that Pfizer is providing to other countries. To make up for a lack of doses, the federal government asking immunizers to get six doses rather than five out of each vial, something the province says is very difficult to do. That we can't rely on getting six doses out of every vial. The vials aren't standardized. Typically we get six doses out of around three quarters of the, uh, the vials that we receive. And there, that's only if we're using a very specific syringe that adds another constraint on the logistics. So where does the vaccine supply stand right now? And in the next month to the end of February, we're now, uh, we now expect a bit under 100,000 doses from Pfizer and around 50,000 doses from Moderna. So in theory, we'll have the half million doses that we need for the next phase by the end of March. But given the news over the past week, we have to treat any plan at this time now as tentative. So far, over 100,000 Albertans have received one dose and about 11,000 have received both.